Hey everybody, it's Jay Blue, and today I'm going to review on the Megra doll from the Disney's Art Collection Midnight Masquerade series. I got it from my local Disney store, and I'm super excited that Disney decided to give Megra a chance in the spotlight by giving her a doll. And she's one of my favorite underrated Disney princesses or heroines from the line, and I'm just super excited to have her right here from the Disney store. So be sure to check your local Disney store to see if they have her in stock just for you. Start of the box, it's purple with the Disney Star Collection logo on it, with some embroidery patterns on there too. And on the very top of the box, there's some gold swirly embroidery patterns with the Midnight Masquerade series logo on there too. And going down, you can see Megra's beautiful artwork of her masquerade mask, all in gold, with the Pegasus wings, some lower leaves, Greek designs, some gemstones, and some flowers on there that Hercules gave to Megra in the movie. And it's all decorated, all these intricate cutouts. It's very unique, very pretty. And going down, it says Midnight Masquerade Series, ages 6 and up. And on the side of the box, it says Megra written in gold. And you can see Megra's artwork or art sketch. It's very pretty. And here is the back of the box. And you can see Megra's full body artwork created by the wonderfully talented Steve Thompson. It's so pretty, I love her. She's a goddess. And on the left side, you see a short summary of the Midnight Masquerade series. You can pause and read if you like. And the bottom says, it's in French, and it says, Certificate of Authenticity and Space Stand Included. I'll be right back to give you guys a better look at this beautiful goddess right there. I'll be right back. Alright, on to the doll herself. Megara has really long brunette hair, it's all wavy, and it's tied to a ponytail. And she's wearing a golden headband made out of lower leaves. And they did a really good job with her hair. It's all had those signature curls and her wave too. And she has rooted eyelashes with lavender eyeshadow with her signature eyebrows. And she's wearing darkish pink lipstick. And her masquerade mask is all golden with the Pegasus wings, some purple gemstones or amethysts. With the flowers in her too. And her handle is kind of like a column, which you can see in Greek buildings. And it's attached to another handle, which is made out of lower leaves too. And onto her dress, there's a golden shoulder piece attaching chains. And her dress is very pretty, very Greek inspired. There's all the layers, and the first area is all like, like drapes, and it has a purple belt. It has a golden trim or fringe. And the top part of her dress, the bodice, it's dark purple with some golden embroidery. And it's attached to this sleeve that is like a cape. Well, it actually is a cape, and it goes down to her dress. It's very dramatic, we love it. And she's wearing golden bracelets. There are four of them. And down to her dress, the skirt. It has two layers. The first layer is like a sheer lavender color with some golden embroidery. With flowers, leaves, and some gemstones on her too. And it's finished off with a golden fringe too. And here's a little cutout of the flowers that Hercules gave to her in the movie before she sang the song I Won't Say I'm in Love. And this doll comes with this doll stand, and which is a good good bonus to display your dolls. And here's the second layer of the dress, this is all lavender. And down to her shoes, it's golden and it's like high heels and is wrapped up in golden ribbons. Yeah, it's very pretty, we really love it. Alright, and here's my certificate of authenticity. I have 1,359 of 52,000. Alright, and onto the box. You can see a little background and of the little Cupid statue in there too. And it's surrounded with all these swirly cutouts. With a chandelier on the background too. Alright. So that's it for my review, and I'm super excited that Megra has her own doll in this line, and it's been a while since we have a Megra doll in the late 1990s, and it's, real, it's a real honor to have her in this time. She's very pretty, really love her. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.